Hey, what's going on guys? And welcome to Facebook Ads Friday week 30. So if this is your first week tuning in, every single week on a Friday, I will show you two proven and profitable products. How do I know they're proven and how do I know they're profitable? Well, for example, then just to give you a quick glimpse of the first product, we can see that this particular Facebook post has a million views, 3000 comments and 11,000 reactions. If we take a quick scroll through the comment section, we can see how it's littered with people who have bought this product and are happy happy with this product. These are great indicators that the ad is successful and it's proof and evidence that people are buying the product. What's also really important about every single product I show you on these Fridays is that they are all current and active. So if you are watching this video right now and you do not have a product that is currently selling successfully for you, then I recommend you subscribe so every single Friday you can get two great options to go out there and test. Not only do I show you the products, I will show you the Shopify stores, the product descriptions, the product pages, I should say, that are converting. So you have a winning creative, a winning Shopify store, winning description. And I will also show you where you can source these products from. So you know exactly what you're buying it for, exactly what you're selling it for, exactly how to advertise it, exactly how to put together a product page. Essentially, you have everything you need to go out there and create something similar and replicate the same success you're about to see in this video. So straight into product number one, we'll start with the creative so you can see exactly what it is. I don't know if you can hear that music, but it's so annoying. In fact, I'm gonna turn it right down. It's just crazy, crazy music, really annoying, but sometimes that works really well because it gets people's attention. It forces them to stop and watch the video. That coupled with a cute dog, interacting with the products, doing silly things, digging, and ultimately just showing how effective this product is. It's the sort of video that somebody would want to watch regardless of whether they actually have a dog or interested in the products or not, because people just love pet videos like this, especially on platforms like Facebook. So whether they recorded this themselves or it's just recycled content from online, um, it goes without saying they've been able to make this pretty successful. Let's take a look at the boring side of the ad then. So this is from a company called love happy pets so you guys can obviously go and check these out um, the post went live on march 30th we are on may 17th so what's that all of april and a couple of weeks of may so in about six weeks they've been able to get a million views 3,000 comments and 11,000 reactions um, it says approved by veterinarians worldwide i'm not sure how that's relevant or whether it's even true or not um, but nonetheless as the comment section which i've already shown you if i just go back to the top and point out some of these we can see that people love this product and they're definitely definitely buying it. So Christine's posted that her girls love theirs. I think they're actually, um, well, they're certainly not dogs, but nonetheless, there's somebody who's bought one. Um, Cheryl Taz loved the sprinkler. There's another person who's bought one. Tammy, we've had this for past two summers. Another person that's bought one. My dog hates the water, but loves this. Another person that's bought one. Maggie, best toy ever. Picture of her dog. Another person that's bought one. Deborah, my dogs love this. Another person. We have one in our springer. Loves it. Another person. Christy ordered. As we can see, lots and lots of people who have bought this product um, all within the last kind of few weeks. Somebody's even gone to the extent to post video of theirs um, just to obviously confirm it is relevant let's go for some of the newest comments so 40 minutes ago 49 minutes ago four hours an hour an hour an hour five hours one hour these guys are putting a fair bit of money into this i would say to get that level of commentary um, or level of comments um, on the ad so it must be making them return obviously nobody continues to run a facebook ad up to a million views um, and pass that unless they're seeing some sort of return from it onto the shopify store then so this is it it's essentially um, quite a basic one um, if I may say so and um, they haven't even gone to the extent of getting their own imagery this screams supplier stock image um, straight away obviously it hasn't even got the same background as the rest of their store that probably be difficult to do given the um, effect of the water to remove the background and have it blend in with the background of their store but nonetheless it's still successful um, five stars I think that says 127 not the easiest to see so I think there's a couple of design flaws um, in my opinion with this store but nonetheless um, again, who am I to say they've been successful? So if it works, then you don't need to fix it. Product description is as textbook as they come. So um, heading followed by paragraph, followed by GIF or image. That's a really nice GIF, a really cute dog in the product, enjoying the product. Um, and like I said, similar case with the video, people like to watch this sort of thing, regardless of whether they're interested in what they're selling or not. Um, again, title, 
paragraph GIF, title paragraph GIF, um, very textbook layout, um, and nonetheless effective. Down into the reviews then, lots and lots of different reviews, lots and lots of different social proof, gives off a really good impression of how well received this product is from the consumers. Um, and again, people coming onto this store would have no hesitations shopping with these guys, given the level and amount of reviews they have and how good the reviews are and all the imagery and all the different dogs that have shown happiness using this product. So they're selling at 150 by 150 for 53 pounds. Um, let's jump onto AliExpress. Um, I went for these guys because they're a top brand. They've been in business for four years now, which is pretty decent for a supplier on AliExpress. They're called CDDM Store. If you want to check them out and actually use them yourselves. And they do come with 15 day delivery as well. That is with an on time guarantee. Um, and if you want to sell at 150 by 150, it's going to cost 13 pounds and 10 pence. If you take that away from what these guys are selling for, you're actually looking at nearly a 40 pound profit before your marketing expenses, which is a very, very healthy the amount you should be able to require customers for products like this given my experience in the dog niche for 15 and certainly under 20 pounds so that's even after the marketing costs a profit of 20 pounds per sale you'd only have to sell 10 of these a day to making 200 pounds a day which is about 70 grand profit a year before taxes so in my opinion a really solid product um, definitely 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 with lots of potential over the few um, coming months moving on to product number two then so we'll start off by taking a look at the ad creative um, this again screams kind of like supplier stock footage um, there's no one talking there's this information at the top but I'll show you in a second it is of course um, a foreign store um, it's not a UK based store but sometimes the simpler ads are the best ones because you don't want to overcomplicate it you want a kind of quality rather than quantity approach it clearly shows exactly what the product does um, and, and at the end of the day that's what an effective ad does um, and that's also reflected in the results that they've been able to get as well so if we jump up we can see this is a product from a company called Astus Dash Product um, it went live on April 22nd of 2021 so it's been around for a couple of years now it shows it is a tried and tested and working product if we go down into the comments section um, ignore the Time frames. I'll show you the newest in a second so you can see it is still working today. What I'm going to do is just click on a few of these um, translations and see if we can find anyone that's bought it. Yes, it's nice. I only pay by check. Um, I love this fountain. I had two, they lasted about a summer, too bad. So there's somebody who's bought one. Um, I almost installed one last year. Um, so there's somebody who else has bought one. This is difficult to do. Maybe I should have clicked on C translations before doing the video, but nonetheless, I think you get the gist. Given the level of viewership, so 2,400 comments, 2.3 million views and 15,000 reactions. I think it goes without saying um, a post wouldn't get this level. So there's somebody who's posted a picture of theirs. This post wouldn't get this level of kind of engagement and comments unless they were seeing a return. Just to kind of um, prove it's still working right now as well. So if we go for newest, we can see one day, one day. In fact, that's somebody's recently who's actually bought one. There's another person from one day ago um, um, one week, one week, there's a person here who actually posted a video three days ago, um, two days. This one says a year, but if we open up replies, it will be because there's recent replies. So five days, two days. So as we can see, lots and lots of comments all within the last few days. So you guys get the idea it's working right now. Onto the Shopify store then, what I'm gonna do is just translate this um, so we can understand it. It's a very basic layout. Like I mentioned in the previous Shopify store, very textbook one as well. Um, so you got title followed by um, paragraph slash bullet points followed by image. These are stock images taken from suppliers. These guys could definitely do a better job. And um, they've highlighted the key points in bold, which is another kind of um, popular strategy for people to use. Title, paragraph, image. Quite an amateurish type store, not to kind of take shots at the store or, or downplay their level of success. But this is what I was talking about in my video on Monday is that countries like France or Spain, where people don't very commonly drop ship they are not used to the level of competition that the likes of the uk or australia or america are which means you can get away with a lot less amateurish or a lot more amateurish looking stores i should say um, and selling these types of products it is a great strategy to adopt as long as you can have a slick store in terms of the translation you need an app which translates the store so it sounds like a local who's been writing it and that's really difficult difficult to do or you need to pay somebody on Fiverr to go onto your Shopify store or translate every piece of text comments 
information that you send them basically a local who can speak and read and write fluently um, to translate your store for you so that again when somebody comes on the store from france shopping in euros feels like this is a french store not an american store that's just been translated and misleading so they're selling this product for 35 euros um, if we jump onto aliexpress just to point out as well that was a 16 centimeter diameter this is for the same product 16 centimeter diameter 469 with free shipping so what's that in euros about 550 maybe six they're selling it for 35 so give or take you're looking at 30 euros of room so again a very healthy profit margin there to acquire your customers with and with that being said then guys that is a wrap for facebook ads friday week 30 hope you guys enjoyed this week hope you guys enjoyed the products i hope more importantly um you give them a go and i hope more importantly than that um you make them successful for you and you can make some money from this video any help at all um getting started with these products come back to this video drop a comment i read every single one so i will give you my best and honest answer as well to help you guys out as much as possible don't forget to like the video if you want to see more and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more thanks guys i'll see you in the next video have a great weekend i'll see you on monday cheers